Hi, this is Ron McTube. Today on Where the Hunter, we're here to talk about the brand new update version 1.23 has just gone to the development branch on Steam. So we're going to have a look at the patch notes. I've been waiting for this for a few months now and it's nearly here, but it's on the dev branch just going out. I've just heard the ping as I was hunting on Aurora's Shore. So let's talk about it and the patch notes and see what we've got in store. A lot to cover, so let me get on with it. They've added taxidermy stands for landowners' cottages in Nez Perce Valley, Transylvania, and Aurora Shores. They've added rare fur variations for animals in Aurora Shores, albino, wood bison, and melanistic Alaskan moose. Can't wait to see those, that's brilliant. Added Aurora Shores achievements, added ambient volume slider in audio options, added progress reset in the settings, added rare fur, Identify it in the claim screen, that's a big one. Added Aurora Shores new discoverable fast travel destinations, parking lots. Added possibility to close tutorial pop ups. Added sound effects for traversing water. In multiplayer, they've added exploration marker multiplayer support. Tweet visual improvements to albino animals, that's a big one. Tweet changes to the life cycles of big game animals and predators. They've tweaked Nez Perce Valley's elk specified to Rocky Mountain elk. They've tweaked Nez Perce Valley's moose specified to Western moose. They've tweaked high distance visibility of small animals. Tweaked hunting log sorting change to new to old. They tweaked the controls. Exit vehicle is now square slash X consistent with enter vehicles. Vehicle horn is now circle slash B. Default controller sensitivity of look increased by 30%. They've tweaked environmental imperfections, defects. Tweaked taxidermy stands, clipping through ceilings, walls when populated with large trophies. That's a big one. Tweaked mission, surge as shooting, initial voice over playback and target marker. Tweet corrected the rotation speed of arrows in the bullet camera. Tweet camera snapping while moving in prone or a slope that's a big one they've tweaked the sound clues tweaked alert distribution for animals when crossbow hunting they've tweaked optimizations for static animal signs grass system and hunter sense decals they've fixed auto walk deactivating when using binoculars fixed incorrect trophies displayed for Young and adult animals in taxidermy assistant. Fixed vehicle position being persistent between multiplayer and single player. Fixed inability to exit a vehicle while parked in a bush. Fixed firearm UI elements sometimes disappear when quickly switching gear. They fix fires in fireplaces in Aurora Shores, Lodge and Cottages. They fix binoculars occasionally not displaying the hunter sense info. They fixed animals making somersaults over the water. Fix blood tracks stopping if an animal despawns when fleeing. Fixed animal trophy scores over 500. Fix campsite map icon missing in Transylvania. Fix time of day not pausing while in menu. Fix animals with incorrect fitness responding to calls. Fix pathfinding of called animals. Fix wolves disappearing at 500 meters. Fix detached caribou head on a taxidermy stand. Fixed Remington 1903 accuracy when using iron sights. Partially fixed, occasionally wrong animal pose in the bullet camera, causing bullet trajectory and damage to not line up. Partially fixed mission animals not spawning in previously pressured herds. What an update this will be when it comes to live. Can't wait. It's on the dev branch now on Steam. Make sure you back up your save if you're going to try it out. But so many fixes, tweaks additions of rare animals rare animal identifiers some animals were hard to tell if there was rares or not they've added in the trophy screen now what it is what type of rare so you can't mistake it so many good fixes tweaks it's took a while for this update to come out but it's been worth waiting for they made sure that this update is going to be a big one can't wait to hunt aurora shores for rare wood bisons melanistic mooses now we're out trophy hunting <laughs> can't wait i've been waiting for this update for so long anticipating it and now we're so close to getting it can't wait you gonna have to go try this also this week i've got some epic trophy hunts for where the hunter uh, for the last week i've been going after some of my favorite animals which i haven't got trophies of 
and I have now. Let's just put it like that. I'm not going to ruin it, but I've got some epic videos for you this weekend. Also remember, we've got a brand new map coming soon for Way of the Hunter as well. So this is just starting to get really juicy now. It's a great game already, but these updates, tweaks, additions, more rares, more trophies, new maps... I can't wait to see what we've got coming. What map do you think it is? There's been a lot of discussion about this. Some people think it's Africa. Some people think it's Australia. Loads of different sort of locations. But I can't wait to see what we've got. But this update has blown me away. Also, apparently, my mission I've been trying to do for since where the hunter come out, it bugged out. Apparently, that's fixed. I gave him my save file and uh, Mikhail says, check that out, Ron. See if it's fixed. So we'll have to go have a look at that as well so that's a little additional bonus um i'm just over the moon and it's gonna be nice to get right back into way of the hunter again and uh, sink some more time into it i've been off it for the last few weeks but this week i've been on it solely um just getting after trophy animals and like i say wait to see these videos i've got for you one of them especially right i've been hunting for since way of the hunter come out and uh, when I spotted it the other day, and I nearly shed a tear because I was so happy. Because I've been after it and I put a lot of hours in trying to get one. And uh, it was so nice to finally get one. So, today we've been looking at the development branch Steam patch notes for update version 1.23. It's a massive patch. Um, not really in size, but just in what's in it. And uh, I can't wait for it to launch on live. But it's on Steam, on the dev branch. Like I say, if you're going to try it, make sure you back up your save it's quite easy to do and uh, join the where the hunter official discord that's where you learn about things first and there's a lot of us from the community there chatting daily having fun giving each other's tips and um, so i hope you enjoyed this video so i'm ramit tube we've been talking about 1.23 update on steam on the dev branch i'm ramit tube please subscribe to my youtube channels hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching bye bye